The first activity that you will do in your JAS Practive course will usually be the course benchmark, also known as the benchmark. To start the course benchmark, first click on the Go To Course link at the bottom of your selected course option. On the next screen, click on the Launch Benchmark button. The benchmark starts by showing the instructions. Please take the time to read them carefully. The maximum time to complete the benchmark is usually 50 minutes. Once ready, click the Continue button at the bottom of the instructions. The tasks which make up the benchmark exercise appear in the right-hand instruction pane on the right side of the screen. A countdown timer counting down from 50 minutes down to zero appears at the top of the instruction pane. You can increase or decrease the size of the instruction pane listing the tasks and the same can be done to the Office Program window pane, in this case, the Excel window pane. There are toggle buttons within the instruction pane. The A- toggle button allows you to decrease the font size of each task instruction. The A plus toggle button allows you to increase the font size of each task instruction. There is also a copy selected text button in case students wish to copy text from the instructions. At the top of the instruction pane, there are more toggle buttons. The one with the question mark, when clicked, will show a short guide of how to use the instruction pane. The one with the curved double arrow and two straight lines, when clicked, will move the instruction pane from a vertical to a horizontal position on your screen, like this. Clicking it again will move the instruction pane back to its vertical position. The last two toggle buttons are a minus and an X. The minus button minimizes the instruction pane, and the X will ask if you wish to close down Jasper Active. Only click these if necessary. There are resource files found at the bottom of the instruction pane, which you can double click on and work on if the current task instructs you to do so. Starting at task one, follow what each task instructs you to do, like, for example, the first task asks you to open a file from a location in the Documents folder. The buttons towards the bottom of the instruction pane are as follows. Save, which will allow you to save your current progress. Do ensure you follow the proper instructions when prompted to save your current progress Next and previous buttons, which will take you to either the next task or the previous task that you are working on. The Submit button will submit and score your progress in the course benchmark. It is advisable that you only click the Submit button if you have completed the course benchmark. When clicked, JazzPract will ask you to submit results or exit without submitting. If you click on Exit without submitting, JazzPract takes you back to your main student account page without providing you a score on your course benchmark. Whereas, if you click on the Submit Results button, it will complete the benchmark and upload your results.